ever wondered about the common misconceptions surrounding the daily ritual of drinking lemon water? Well, it's time we debunked some of these myths and set the record straight. Firstly, contrary to popular belief, it's not beneficial to drink lemon water on an empty stomach, especially during fasting. This practice may exacerbate chronic diseases of the gastrointestinal tract, primarily gastritis and peptic ulcer. Secondly, always opt for freshly squeezed lemon juice. This ensures you're getting the maximum amount of vitamins and antioxidants. Try to avoid lemon concentrates as they often contain added sugars and unnecessary additives. Thirdly, use warm water to make your lemon water. Warm water activates the digestive system, stimulating natural digestion and improving overall gastrointestinal function. Now, here's a tip. Avoid drinking lemon water immediately after a meal. This could dilute the gastric juices, making digestion more difficult. Instead, consume it 15 to 30 minutes before a meal or one hour after a meal. But there's something else to consider. Protecting your tooth enamel. The citric acid in lemon water could impact the enamel of your teeth, potentially leading to tooth decay and tooth loss. Drinking lemon water through a straw and rinsing your mouth with plain water or a saline solution afterwards can help mitigate these effects. If you're new to the world of lemon water, start with a lower concentration and gradually increase as your body adapts. And remember, always consult a medical professional before making any significant changes to your diet. Keep watching to the end, where I reveal a very important tip with regards to vitamin C and storing lemons. Consistency is key when it comes to reaping the full benefits of drinking lemon water. Regular consumption will help to maintain optimal levels of vitamin C and other nutrients. Feel free to get creative with your lemon water. Adding ingredients like honey or ginger not only enhances the flavor, but also introduces additional health benefits. Always pay attention to how your body reacts. If you notice an increased sensitivity to acid, consider reducing the concentration of lemon. Remember, moderation is important. Avoid drinking excessive amounts of lemon water to prevent an acid overload in your body. In the next scene, I will reveal the potential issues of drinking lemon water and how to deal with them. But first, do me this small, quick and easy, but significantly very important favor. It will only take a few seconds to complete. As you're seated there watching this video, I'd like you to reach out for your device and on it, you'll see a thumbs up symbol. Click on it. Though it might seem like a small thing, but clicking on that thumbs up button carries immense significance. By clicking on it, not only are you showing your appreciation for the information contained within this video, but you're also helping to bring this content to the attention of other viewers. Imagine that little click as a ripple in a pond, extending outwards to touch and influence many others. It's a small act, but its impact can be massive, spreading this valuable knowledge far and wide. Then, once this video has ended and you've absorbed all the information it has to offer, what then? Well, don't keep it to yourself. The power of knowledge is in its distribution and in its sharing. I urge you to share this video across your social networks, through your emails and on all other platforms. In this age of information overload, quality content can often get lost. By sharing, you're ensuring that this valuable information reaches as many people as possible, contributing to a collective increase in knowledge. Now you might be asking, is that all? Not at all. There's another step you need to take to stay updated with all the informative videos that I'm posting look out for the subscribe button. By clicking on it, you're not just subscribing to a channel, but you're also joining a community of knowledge seekers who understand the importance of staying informed and updated. But don't stop at subscribing, there's more. Notice the little bell icon next to the subscribe button? That's the notification bell. Click on it and then select all. By doing this, you're ensuring that you never miss out on any new videos that are posted. Oh, and by the way, if you watch this video from your television, you need to perform all these actions from your mobile phone or your computer. You may now wonder, why should I subscribe? The answer is straightforward. Subscribing to my channel doesn't cost you anything. It's absolutely free. Moreover, my channel is a treasure trove of information on how to live a healthy lifestyle. You'll gain access to a plethora of healthy recipes with easy to follow step-by-step -step instructions. 
These recipes are not just delicious, they're also designed to fuel your body with the right nutrients. Apart from this, you will learn about superfoods, those nutrient powerhouses that can boost your health and energy. I don't just tell you what they are, but also explain their health benefits. Knowledge like this empowers you to make conscious, informed decisions about your diet. Furthermore, this channel seeks to educate you on how to listen to your body. Our bodies are constantly communicating with us, sending us signs that tells us when something is off balance. By being part of my channel, you'll learn to interpret these signs to understand when all is not well within your system. This knowledge is invaluable. It allows you to take proactive steps in taking care of your health. Now, it's not just about me talking. I, I want to hear from you as well. Your comments, suggestions and queries all enrich this platform. They help me understand your needs better and give me an idea of how to curate content that's more relevant to you. So don't hesitate. Make a comment. It could be a question, a suggestion or just a simple greeting. Remember, this channel is a dialogue, not a monologue. So are you ready? Ready to be part of this knowledge pack community? Go ahead and make a comment. I would love to hear from you. If you develop a rash after drinking lemon water, it may indicate problems with your microbiome and digestion. It's crucial to seek professional help in this case. Likewise, if you experience allergic reactions such as sneezing or hives, stop drinking lemon water immediately and consult a medical professional. Lastly, refrain from storing lemons in the refrigerator. Though they may stay fresher for longer, the vitamin C content can be reduced by exposure to extremely cold temperatures. So, there you have it. A comprehensive guide to drinking lemon water correctly. Remember, it's all about balance, moderation and listening to your body. Thank you for joining me on this enlightening journey. Your time and interest are much appreciated, and it has been a pleasure sharing this journey of health and wellness with you. Your comments, thoughts and experiences are invaluable, so don't hesitate to leave them down below in the comment section. By sharing this video with your loved ones, you may inspire them to embark on their own health journey. However, it's essential to note that the information provided here is intended for educational and informational purposes only. It is not intended to replace professional medical advice, diagnosis or treatment. We all have unique dietary needs and health conditions, so before making significant changes to your diet or lifestyle, please consult with a healthcare professional or a registered dietitian, especially if you have underlying health conditions. Your health is your most significant asset and it's crucial to make informed decisions under the guidance of professionals. Remember, there isn't a one-size-fits-all solution to health, and what works for one person may not work for another. Work with your healthcare provider to make the best decisions for your health. Therefore, use this information as a starting point, and in the meantime, keep an eye out for my next upcoming video. Until my next video, stay healthy, stay happy, and keep learning.